Jennifer Hodges reports a judge overseeing the case has delayed her sentencing. It's a reprieve for Elizabeth Holmes, convicted on four counts of felony fraud in connection with her blood testing company. This ruling was a win-win for Holmes' defense team. She got her sentencing delayed. She still has her hopes set on getting a new trial. That's legal analyst Steve Clark. The judge agreed to a hearing to find out more about Dr. Adam Rosendorf, a former Theranos lab director, and he felt guilty for testifying. When Dr. Rosendorf showed up unannounced to Ms. Holmes to talk to her about his testimony, it certainly gave the defense a reason to seek more information from him on the witness stand to see if his testimony was inaccurate or incomplete during the trial. Holmes is expected to serve a multi-year prison sentence, but that might not be anytime soon, depending on if she gets a new trial. Jennifer Hodges, KCBS. KCBS News. I'm 10:13. The 49ers D making a statement, and teams are sitting up and listening. We check in with Ted Ramey. Coming up. Buy your car completely online, or reserve your brand new ride while in transit. Hey, it's Sean Doe Grant of BGDT, and right now is the perfect time to take advantage of exciting incentives on brand new cars, trucks, SUVs, and electric vehicles. All of our Northern California locations. We've got thousands of vehicles to choose from, with brand new models arriving daily. You can buy your new or used car from start to finish completely online with our exclusive no-brainer checkout. And yes, you can even reserve your new vehicle while in transit. Now that makes me happy. So be happy. Just shop online and buy online. Spend more time enjoying your ride and less time at the dealership. Join over 300,000 happy car buyers and experience the fast, easy, and hassle-free know me, it's probably because I'm not famous. But I did start a men's grooming company called Harry's. The idea for Harry's came out of a frustrating experience I had buying razor blades. Most brands were overpriced, overdesigned, and out of touch. At Harry's, our approach is simple. Here's our secret. We make sharp, durable blades and sell them at honest prices for as low as $2 each. We care about quality so much that we do some crazy things, like buy a world-class German blade factory. Obsessing over every detail means we're confident in offering a 100% quality guarantee. Millions of guys have already made the switch to Harry's, so thank you if you're one of them. And if you're not, we hope you give us a try with this special offer. Get a Harry starter set with a five-blade razor, weighted handle, shave gel, and a cover, all for just three bucks, plus free shipping. Just go to harrys.com and enter code JOY at checkout. That's harrys.com, code JOY. Enjoy. Coming up on KCBS. I'm Bob Butler in Oakland where the police chief says the justice system is one of the reasons why violence is so bad. These systems have become a revolving door. KCBS News Time, 1015. 49ers defense comes through again. Here's Ted Rain. The 49ers defense is entering some pretty spectacular territory. Joe Buck with the call for ESPN on one of two sacks on the night for Nick Bosa. The 49ers had seven sacks overall in the game. The 49ers are tops in the league in points allowed per game, yards per rush, yards per play, yards per game, and sacks per drawback. They haven't allowed a touchdown in the first half all year, and in the first quarter, they've only given up three points, and that happened last night. I think it's best in the league. That's kind of our mindset every year, and, and this year we have personnel to do it not not that we haven't in the past but just all all three levels is elite players that's nick bosa speaking after the win at the 49ers post game presser who in addition to his two sacks had 14 quarterback pressures as far as head coach kyle shanahan's thoughts on the d i'm um, just the core um you know with the linebackers some key guys on defensive line you know jimmy's ward's been here for a while i know he hasn't been able to play this year and these two new safeties have stepped in you know e-man's been here for a long time being able to add mooney our coaching staff we've got a lot of continuity there domico has been here since day one johnny holland's been since day one chris Derrick came year three so i would say it's that 49ers are also the first team to keep the Rams from scoring a touchdown since Seattle did it in late 2020. 49ers are now 2-2 two and two on the year and head to Carolina this Sunday. At the sports desk, Ted Ramey, KCBS. My brother-in-law died suddenly, and now my sister and her kids have to sell their home. 
That's why I told my husband we could not put off getting life insurance any longer. An agent offered us a year $500,000 policy for nearly $50 a month. Then we called Select Quote. Select Quote found us identical coverage for a month, a savings of $369 a year. Whether you need a $500,000 policy or a $5 million policy, Select Quote could save you more than 50% on term life insurance. For your free quote, call Select Quote at 1 800 635 3311. That's 1 800 635 3311. Or go to SelectQuote.com. 1 800 635 3311. That's 1 800 635 3311. Select Quote. We shop. You save. Full details on example policies at selectquote.com slash commercials. We don't take a break from what we do. We cover the news around the clock. How long were you stuck? I've been on that uh, train since 7.03 a.m. So I, I would say almost two hours even on that train. We are the only news station broadcasting live from the Bay Area every hour of the day, every day of the week. We began to slow down to stop. Sometimes that happens, but this time we really stopped for like very long time to the point where we're like, what's going on? It's one more reason why we're the Bay Area's number one news station. All news, all the time, right here on KCBS. Say, Gene at KCBS, got to check your midday ride in Oakland. For that, we head to Victor Zaragoza. Yeah, on the 80 westbound, headed to the toll plaza of the Bay Bridge. Back up at the toll plaza, but once you get uh, around that area, you're going to see some brake lights. That's due to the metering lights are still on at the toll bridge. Uh, excuse me, at the toll plaza, so that's the reason you're sluggish. This traffic report is brought to you by MB Jesse Painting. Once you're on the bridge, you'll definitely stay under the speed limit all the way to downtown San Francisco. It does ease up by the time you get to the uh, 9th Street exit. After that, it's a smooth ride as you continue on the southbound 101. All that uh, heavy traffic that was on southbound 101 has pretty much disappeared already. It was an earlier crash that was blocking lanes. That has been cleared for a bit now, so you have the rest of your ride all the way to SFO. You are clear and at the speed limit. That's actually looking really good there. Still looking at slow traffic coming out of Castro Valley as you head on 580 westbound transition and northbound 238. Headed towards the San Lorenzo, San Leandro area. You're, off, uh, you're definitely on and off the brakes until you get past East 14th Street. And if you happen to transition to southbound 880, you get very heavy traffic until you get to around Winton Avenue on 880 southbound. And that would be in Hayward after that. It's a pretty smooth ride, especially if you jump on Highway 92 headed to the San Mateo Bridge. In the westbound direction, that is clear. Not the Are you a commercial property owner or manager working on 2022 painting plans? MB Jesse Painting offers full repaints and maintenance painting, carpentry, and wood rot repairs. Why wait? Call 855 MB Jesse today or online at mbjesse.com. Your next traffic update at 1028 on the traffic leader, KCVS. Six days of really nice weather ahead. Mostly sunny skies after the fog and overcast burns off. Already doing so in the inland valleys, 60s and 70s at the beaches. 70s mid to upper 80s inland tomorrow. Partly cloudy in the morning, sunny in the afternoon, and then Thursday through the weekend. Warming continues. Sunny skies and high 70s and 80s at the coastal areas, mid 80s to low 90s for the inland areas. Traffic and weather together on the 8th, all news 1069 and AM 740 KCBS. KCBS News Time 1021. Oakland's police chief says the department is making progress in reducing violence. KCBS reporter Bob Butler says the chief admits he is frustrated that many of the people that officers arrest are quickly released from custody. Chief Laurent Armstrong says what the department is doing is working. Crime plans, we have them. Extra officers on the streets, we have them. Focused enforcement, we're doing it. There are more people willing to use them right now. The problem, he says, is a lot of those people are being released after being arrested. We need everybody's help, and that includes the district attorney's office. That includes our local judges to hold people accountable when they are arrested with these firearms. Don't let them back out into our community to continue to drive gun violence. In Oakland, Bob Butler, KCBS. Vallejo Police Chief Shawnee Williams has fired an officer for use of deadly force in the controversial shooting death of Sean Monterosa in June of 2020. Now, the chief didn't name the officer, but the Vallejo son reports it was Detective Jarrett Khan who opened fire on Monterosa through the windshield of his patrol car. 
Don says he thought Monterosa had a gun. Turns out it was the ha uh, handle of a hammer.